Yo, what's going on, sexy seven letters? Today we're doing a tilt Tuesday. I mean, you don't really have to say the Tuesday after you say tilt because it's in it's in the name, but you get the picture. Uh, so we're playing Ratatasker here. I think Ratatasker is extremely good, but also needs a little bit of help. Like, I think he's really good, but he he. He doesn't do everything perfectly. Like his fighting potential is a little lackluster. No, he in conquest his role is obviously an assassin. You roll in or you alt in mainly. You blow someone up and then you leave. Uh, that's not ever gonna happen in duel ever because this is duel. They have one person to focus on and all of their abilities up at every moment. So uh, you're never gonna catch someone out, but. That being said, I'm going to try to get four games at least before I hold an L with Ratatasker and use one of every acorn. That is the goal of today's video. But I am starting with green acorn. Because not, not only do I think the green acorn is the best acorn, because it is, because you heal so much and you get 10% max health and your sustain is crazy with it. So not only do I think that it's the best acorn, which it might not be, let's be honest, like it could definitely still be the damage one. But uh, I also just have the most fun with this acorn. Because it gives you so much outplay potential. You can punch me in the head all you want, my dude. As if I care. As if I cared. What if I just like altered you though? You got no mana. Oh, it's too easy. Oh, it's too easy, dude. It's too easy. All right. I'm not going to buy anything because I'm just going to upgrade my acorn. And I can run out as far as I can before upgrading it. Thank you. That blue buff saved my tukus. Saved my tukus. And now I heal for a percentage of my max health on every ability. Which is... I don't really have to tell you, but very good. Because it gives me a massive amount of sustain. And then, on top of that, once I finish my Soul Eater, you can, you can imagine the amount of sustain we're about to have in this game. It's going to be crazy. Right now, it's not really that much because, you know, obviously he's still pressing buttons and shit, but, um, you know. You don't really have mana, do you? You don't. You like fighting without mana. I've noticed. I missed. You're dead? Almost dead. Oh, but you're actually dead here, though. Because I'm going to kill you. You have no mana? And I have a bunch of sustain. You have no mana and I have infinite sustain. Shout out my boy. Green acorn. I don't really want to back yet. I want to do my blue first because. I want to start stacking my soul leader as soon as I can. Oh, he's going defense already. Damn. All right. All right, I can go get my soul leader now. He's going to get red buff, but I don't really care about red buff. I also don't think he can kill me. I mean, if I play it like stupid as shit, yeah, he can kill me. But like in a normal sense where I like have a brain cell, maybe, you know, God forbid, maybe even two brain cells. I don't think he can kill me. Oh, 
Look at that clear. He thinks I'm going to his blue. I'm not. I'm going for that. I will go for his blue, though. Oh, my. He did that so fast. He did it so fast. What the hell? Bonk. 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 My healing is crazy. My healing is actually crazy. What the hell? I took 800 damage and I'm only missing 700, not even 700 health. I healed like 300 in that fight. And I did nothing. I didn't even do anything. I am going to go breastplate. For very obvious reasons that the more abilities I use, the more healing I have. So breastplate plus soul eater plus blue buff equals 40% cooldown. That is ideal, obviously. I'm very close to having my bow finished. Literally just one ability. Like literally just this. Ow. Okay, why are you angry though? Why are you getting why are you getting all all freaked up on me here, bro? I heal 74 health. Oh, I'm so deceased. Ah, no, 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 please. Come on, Healies. Do something better. Oh, God. Oh, God. You're dead. You're dead. You're so dead. He finished his soul eater. That's how, he, that's how he's living. Oh, Jeez. His soul eater, man. My God. What a good item. If only mine was finished. Come on, give me this. Bro, why did it take you this long to clear red buff? I'm never, I'm never going to get it. Come on, please, 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 please. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I don't have all day. Thank you. Thank you. Get me out of here. Thank you. How much did this cost? Get me out of here. Like too much. Did they uh buff breastplate again, by the way? Because it was just twelve hundred. What's the total cost of breastplate right now? Oh, jeez, he's going beat stick. He's going beat stick. I'm going to have to get my own beat stick. I am happy with my cooldown, though. All that shielding. Bro, look at my sustain though. You just just peep it. Are you are you looking? No. Dude, that that alt gave him a proc of his shield which tanked through everything I had. That's actually crazy that that happened that way. Actually crazy. I am going to go meditation for faster cooldowns because obviously. And actually, I could go blink too. Blink could be pretty good. Mm. Come to think of it, blink might be really good. Ow. He's not going beat stick. I thought he was going beat stick, but he's not. He just went crusher.
Okay, just dash to the tower. That's not sick. Actually dead here, maybe. Maybe not. All right, cool. I feel like I should have been dead there. Uh, is your blue up? Nope. Oh, but red is coming up. Maybe he'll he'll go to Bull Demon because he thinks he saw me running that way. Oh, he did see me running that way. He didn't see me coming to red. Yeah, you go to Bull Demon. You go to Bull Demon because I'm doing Bull Demon. Uh-oh, spooky, scary. Don't let him get Bull Demon. Why are you here? Ouch. Oh. All right. Well, that's cool. I'll take it. What if I want to steal his blue buff, though? All right. Blue buff acquired. I don't really care that you're here. <clears throat> oh. It didn't stun. Ow. Come here. He's actually so scared of me. I don't even know why. I have 3,000 gold in hand. Whatever. I'll take it. I'll take the fear. Let's grab a beat stick. Uh, I'll go. I'll go crush her myself. Why not? I still don't have enough for a finished meditation, so I'm not even going to buy it. Dude, my nose is brutal. It's actually brutal. I think I'm sick right now, though. I think I have a sinus infection. That boy be wild. And... Am I fine here? I miss. I am certainly not fine. Actually, I'm doing like kind of good. Ow, that hit me. Fuck. Dude, maybe I am fine. Big healing here. Oh my god, the healing, the healing, the healing, my healing, the healing. Oh my god damn, that's fucking nuts, dude. Can I get this? Um, I can, but I'll die for it. I didn't die for it. That's insane. Am I greedy? How greedy am I? How greedy am I? I'm crazy greedy. I'm the greediest person alive. You'll never find someone more greedy than me. Perfect. Perfect. I'm so greedy and it worked. Oh my God. Oh my God. All right. Cooled on me. Um, I'm going to auto run while I get a fucking nose thing. All right. Um, I should probably have a little bit more health because, you know, my healing, but honestly, I think this is the way you play it. Like you just get the healing one, but you play like you don't have the healing one. I think that's literally the perfect way to play it. I missed again, bro. Say you're bad at rat without saying you're bad at rat.
Does he go for that wave though? If he goes for that wave instead of backs. Oh, you greedy bitch. No. Nice. GG. GG. There it is, boys. There it is, boys. Game one, Ratatasker down, Green Acorn finished. Next up, next up, we got the Damage Acorn. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go Damage Acorn next. The one that does the three, like pew, 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 pew. There's five little ones, you know? All right, see you next game. What's up, boys? Game number two, I'm back and I'm playing Ratatasker, but this time it's gonna be the Damage version. This one, right? Is that one? Yeah, enemies hit by Acorn Blast are debuffed, taking 5% additional damage. From Ratatasker's ability, stacking up to three times, and you fire five blasts now. So, because he's taking additional damage from my abilities and not my auto attacks, let's do ability based. I'm sneezing. I'm not sne. I'm not. I'm not sne. Oh Jesus Christ! What a fucked up day. Uh, let's grab this. I'm probably gonna need beads, but I'm just gonna go straight up shell right now. Who knows? This guy could clap my cheeks. I wouldn't even be surprised, honestly. Does this give me damage? Are all tier 2 acorns the same? Oh, this one is just straight up better. This one heals you for 2% of your max health when you do damage. This one does nothing. That's fucking garbage. Why? 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 I feel like there should be some sort of like thing there for sure. But I don't know. What do I know, dude? What do I know? Yo, he's still doing that buff? Okay, I missed. You die to me though. But I got the shell. He doesn't die to me yet, but like he's close. All right. All right. All right. All right. No big deal. No big deal. I'm okay with this. He hits five here, right? He doesn't hit five, but he's backing. I can't kill him anyways. No big deal. I'm, I'm, I'm cool with this. Because I got my big acorn. The big pow pow, big damage, ouchie, ouchie, ouch acorn. In approximately one XP camp. Perfect. Now I go back because I'm out of mana anyways. I know you don't have to go back to get your acorn, but like I'm out of mana, so I might as well. I'm out of mana, so I might as well. All right. Please don't walk in. All right, so this does five shots now. Yeah, this does five shots now and also increases the damage that my other abilities do. Which doesn't matter that much in the early game, but will matter eventually. Oh my god. Wait, that actually chunked. You're just straight dead to me, right? I'm waiting for the uh, cooldown of my three up. I missed. Okay. He did not expect my three to hit him that hard. I guarantee my three hitting him that hard blew his mind right there. Now right, let's go back. Grab tier two transcendence on a chalice. And I'll, yeah, I'll grab a multi pot too. Why not? Go ahead out. Blew 
blue buff acquired, which is desperately needed at this point. Thank you. And my two does like 500 damage. I mean, my three does like 500 damage right now. That's pretty insane. Do we think? Okay. You have nothing up. I kill you here for sure, for sure, for sure, for sure. Oh. Yes, shell. Alright. He's being a scaredy baby. Okay. I'm being a scaredy baby. I mean, if you're backing now, I just get a free red buff. Okay. I thought he was going to like go aggro after all inning me, but he just all in me and then backed. <laughs> I don't really, I don't really know uh, why he did that. I guess to scare me. Another excellent choice for my to let me know that he's not a pushover and we're not going to be able to just walk all over him like, what if i just altered this though no the orange hearted i'm not even trying to fight you i just wanted to get the wave get my stackies going He's kind of low, actually. Okay. Yeah, you are not in a position to fight me, I don't think. You got no alt. Alright. Alright, him having no alt to just like it basically gives me a free pass to run at him. And hope for the best. Let me back, please. Thank you. We'll go Genji's. Again, this is another like cooldown situation. All of my damage comes from abilities. And in order to do that. Obviously, I need to pull down to use my baby. Alright. Why are you so angry, man? I think I could steal his stuff. Oh, almost. Ow. Ow. Fight me. Your CC is annoying me. Your CC is annoying. Yo, what if I went Magi's? No, that's actually so stupid. The reason it's stupid is because it gets procced 150 different ways. Uh, I'm one wave away from, uh, what is it called? I'm one wave away from finished transcendence, which is going to give me 10% cooldown, which is nice. I really don't want him to get that red buff because that would hurt my soul. Nice. Keep all these boys up. Okay. Okay. You don't win this fight. Like, I get that you're mad that I, I understand that you're mad that I, I took your red buff, but like, you're going to die. I don't know, man. 
little emotional dual play there. I get it. Trust me. I've been there. I've made those plays. It's super annoying when a, when a doofus just walks up and steals your shit. I get it. Ooh, what a shiny sword. But you can't make an entire game losing play off of it. I mean, I'm sure he thought it was a game winning play in the moment because he was mad and he was like, ah, oh, I can fucking kill this guy for stealing it, right? But he, but he can't. He can't. Damn. I don't think I can do this, by the way. I think this will kill me. I mean, it won't kill me, but like, I'll take a lot of damage doing it because I don't have a lot of damage. I Yeah, I'm losing a shit ton of health doing this. Whatever. It's worth it. We'll just back. We'll back and then we'll, we'll go forward with it. I don't do a lot of damage, dude. That that thing hit me for 800 damage. That's a shit ton. Oh god, he got Polly. gonna let me do this wait does he not think that i can take his phoenix oh, there's his beads I don't think you understand that you actually do not hurt me. Nothing you do to me will work. All right, perfect. Perfect. Uh, no, no, I don't need to pick that up. Actually, I kind of do. My cooldown is pretty ass, but I want the red buff. That this man is making some anger plays for sure. Like I could just go Jotun's actually. 2200. I just need 3200 gold to get Jotun's and Crusher on my next back. Which would be pretty massive. I can go get the XP camp that's spawning. Dip my toe in the little speed buff. All right, let's go get Crusher and Jotuns with this back. And then, uh, I don't know what he does. For my pack. Genuinely don't know what he does against this. I just hit a huge power spike. A, like a ginormous power spike. It's, it's really hard to kill him, though, is the problem. That's my current issue. Because he's got so many stuns and he knows he has so many stuns that it's just like, what, like, what do I, realistically, what do I do to kill this man? Never mind, I figured it out. I'm gonna have to wait for the next minion wave. All right, and we win. GG, dude. GG, game two down. Green acorn, yellow acorn, different builds, transcendence, Genji's this time instead of the, uh, oh, the no stacking or the soul leader start with the green. Nice. Uh, I think we're going to try to tackle crit next, which is definitely going to be the hardest. And if this video ends next game, it's because I went crit. See you there. Yo, what's up, boys? We're back with Ratatasker Game 3. I got a latte now in my butt's mug. You see that?
Pog, pog, pog. Um, I recorded a Freya game in between my Ratatasker games because I fought that dude that built triple defense hell and backdoored me while I was playing Kabraken. Obviously, I just like F6 immediately at uh at five minutes. And I wanted like because I was playing Ratatasker and he was playing hell. Uh, and I was like, I'm not I'm not gonna give this guy the time of day. I want to fight him on equal terms. So because hell is an S tier god, I picked Freya. And um I should probably like buy stuff. <clears throat> and I beat him. He picked Scotty because I passed all my bands and I assume he thought that I don't know, Scotty would be the best pick with no bands. Um I beat him. And then he logged on a Smurf account to then snipe my game and dodge it to waste my time and then message me how toxic and big of an ego I have because I was being toxic to him. Even though I said I was being rude because you play like a toxic shitbag. And then he said basically some other stuff. It doesn't really matter. All that matters is that we're game three, even though I've been recording for two hours. <laughs> I am fighting a Bastet. I don't know how I feel about Bastet. By the way, I'm not going crit. Uh, because I'm pretty sure going crit... I think... I don't remember what I said on game two, to be honest with you. Because that was like an hour and a half ago. Um, I think I said I was going to go crit. Oh my god, that was close. Holy shit. Also, he had Sunder. He sundered my shell, bro. I don't remember the last time somebody sundered my shell. Is he a level 5 there? Nice. Not bad. Not bad. We steal the blue buff. He got red buff, but then we got the kill, and then we stole the blues. I got the XP camp too, so I'm I'm two buffs, a kill, and an XP camp ahead right now. That's really good. That's really good. I'm also maxing my two because my Thick Bark Acorn. If you don't know what the White Acorn does because nobody buys it. Basically, it doubles the charge of your two. It's really good for like solo lane. It doubles the uses of your two. Um, and it also gives you the protections that it takes away. So it is really, really good for being tanky in general. So if you look at my prots here, I'm 43 and 45, and then I'll use my two. Uh, okay, it didn't work because it wasn't a god. Does this say only gods? Gloria now provides protections equal to the protection shreds from enemy gods. Okay, so it only works on gods. I didn't know that. But I did want to showcase it. Uh, obviously, my goal with Ratatasker is to show off every single build you could possibly do with it. I've done two of them. I got two more. I need him to show up. There you are. I have 43, 45. And I have 63. I missed. And now I have 73. So I'm getting like 30 protections. From my thing. Yeah, the, the thick bark is really, really good for being tanky. It's really good for like trading. Which actually means it might be good for duel. I do like the thick bark, personally. But I don't know. I like the green one more. Even though the green one doesn't give prots, it gives you like 5% of your max health plus 10% max health. I guess this does give 10% protections. I don't know. Maybe I've been shitting on Thick Park when I shouldn't have. Also, the reason I'm playing Tilt Ratatasker 
is one i don't think he's gonna duel i think he's like okay i have no mana what am i doing i think he's okay at best uh he loses a majority of matchups probably like 80 percent of matchups but that's all right because the point of tilt is to show that matchups aren't everything Sometimes gods that I personally hate are actually decent. By the way, Ratatasker is probably my least hated god out of every tilt I've done so far. Simply because I play him in Conquest. I do like Ratatasker on the Conquest map. I just, like, in Duel, he seems so lackluster. And uh, you know what I think it is? I think it's the fact that he... He's not a burst assassin. Like, I, I'm a huge fan of, like, the bursty assassins. As you guys know, probably. And he's more of, like, a consistent damage. Like, I'm going to stick up. Excuse me. I'm going to stick on you. And I'm going to do damage, 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 damage. And that's that. But I'm not going to be able to burst, you know? Bro, I have 125 protections right now. That's crazy. You have your jump. I missed. Nice. Live! Bitch! Oh my god, 12 health. 12 health. Holy moly. All right, 1625. Bro, they took a whole 100 gold off Breastplate. It used to be 2300, now it's 2200. I mean, it used to be 2300 and then they nerfed it to 2250 and now they nerfed it again? Or they buffed it, I'm sorry. They nerfed the price. You can see my confusion, probably. Go tower shot. That hit me. Come back. Okay. Okay, but what if I ulted you, though? I decided not to. I feel like he was going to ult my ult and then kill me. And I... Uh, uh, I didn't want to look like a fool. So I, uh... I just alt the doors red. It's fine. I need some mana. Oh, your blue's already gone. I think this solely will carry me pretty heavy. I'm pretty sure this is the exact same build that I did with the. Uh... Why do you want to hurt me so much? Oh gosh. I'm actually so tanky. Holy shit. Wait a sec. I'm actually like really tanky. With my two up. Like his alt only did 168 damage. What the hell? gonna go double defense immediately because i feel like not only is it cringe but it also kind of makes my two better right oh i think it makes my two better but it also doesn't really matter mainly because like he's best at he's gonna go max pen anyways he's gonna go 40 percent pen for sure but it matters for the early game. Let's go get the mystical. I could actually just go amp armor and run at him. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck it, we ball. No 
Oh, he just backed over there. All right, you jump the wall. Do I just can I just take tower here? Is that armor? Well, that's not good. Nice, holy. Damn, dude. I took 11 tower shots, by the way. I feel like I'm so tanky. Like, I'm sure some of that is like a, the placebo effect of an extra 10% prots while stealing prots. Like, in my mind, I'm like infinitely tanky. No one can damage me. I'm sure some of that is a placebo. But some of it is also probably true. I gotta sneeze. Never mind, I, I can't sneeze. Oh, I got my nose. Um, what if I just went? I want to go serrated. Go serrated. I just had a glob of caramel. Gross. Gross, gross. Well, he just did holding. All right, fair play. Fair play. I don't know if it matters that much, actually, though. Because my damage is like crazy and also serrated. I mean, uh, not serrated. Oh, God. No, he had a jump. Live, bitch. Do I just get his phoenix here? I think I do. Oh, never mind. He bought blink. Oh, Lord. He coming. Oh, Jesus. I fucked it. No. It's so close. It was so close. I thought it would work, man. Your Damn it. It was so close. <laughs> it did go Titans, man. So my whole double defense shtick barely even works anymore. Coming. <laughs> nice. Thank God for the double charge of my two. The double charge of my two carrying.
I'm just gonna walk in. I mean, I have amp armor, right? Bro, amp armor? I literally double defense, double life steal. Not a bad build. I'm dead. They keep dying to that damn jump. That damn jump, dude. It's not a bad build, honestly. Like, it feels kind of complete. The only thing I need is pen. Like a crusher or a heart seeker. And not even a lot of pen. Just like something to enhance my abilities slightly so that they feel more completed. Like, like complete abilities. I think that play is crusher. I also think that it doesn't matter because I should win before it matters. Like, realistically, next fight, I should be able to win. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Nice. Nice. We cut off his jump path with my with my alt, and then uh, we just we just won. Good stuff, dude. Good freaking stuff. All right, I'll see you guys in the fourth game of Ratatasker of Tilt with the crit chance, which is probably gonna be the the end of me. Let's be honest. What's up, boys? Welcome to the next game. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm playing. I don't know what skin to use. Uh, we can't use festive yet. It's not it's not close enough to, to Christmas. Let's just use Oh, let's use this one. Roar! That's my favorite. I mean honestly, the X the the Raxatosol skin is my favorite. Raxatol skin. But the Ratatasker one's gotta be it's gotta be close. Let's be honest. It's gotta be close. Uh so this one's crit. If I'm going crit. What if I just started Jotuns? Like, is that crazy, stupid psycho? Maybe a little bit. Maybe a little bit. Blake the Ronin. What are Ronins? It's a movie, right? Ronin. It is a movie. The type of samurai, samurai who had no lord or master in some cases had also... Also severed all links with his family or clan. Oh, so it's like a rogue samurai. That's kind of badass. That's kind of badass, dude. All right, Blake, I see you. I mean, he's probably not a Ronin because I doubt that Ronins have internet connection. But like, I, d I also don't even know if samurais still exist. Like, I know that's kind of ignorant. But... Like, don't people just shoot at people now? There's no, no need for swords anymore. <laughs> like, <laughs> very American of me to say, I know, but like, isn't that, isn't that how like wars are fought? With like pew pew ouchy guns? Probably, right? I'm pro I'm probably, I'm probably right. Do I just get this? Or are you going to come over here and like do some shit to me? Yeah. Honk. Well, I got the red buff. I don't even have my ult. 
I don't need my alt, so I, it's not like I am missing out on anything, but... I'm just kind of vibing, man. He started defense. But he started Berserker Shield. Okay. Alright. Oh, hello. Damn, I do damage. I don't even have red buff. Holy crap. Alright, now I buy this. Give me the crit. Nice. So what does this do? Gives me 25% crit chance. Um, my one has a 35% chance to crit. And does more damage. Oh, am I supposed to max my one with this build? Probably. When dart damages an enemy, Ratatasker gains 15% life steal and 20% basic attack damage. That's pretty good. So maybe I build auto attack base. Why the fuck am I going Yotin? <laughs> Alright, clearly I've never used the crit A cord correctly before. You're supposed to max your one and build an auto attack base. That's on me. You missed. Crit. Oh, it worked. What if I kill you though? Do you have alt? Do you have alt? Oh, it can even crit minions. Okay. Honestly, I feel like this is way better than I was giving it credit for. It's probably, it was probably so bad in my head because I had never used it. At least effectively. Because like clearly I just max my two no matter what. I need to max my one though. My one's going to be pumping numbies. Oh. Honk. I have no mana at all. He does have a finished Berserkers. I would love if this was mine. It is mine. I have crit chance. I'm not scared of you. It worked. I have no mana. This is so stupid to do this. All right, back, please. Hurry, 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 hurry. All right, I want Jotun's because cooldown because my dart, obviously, but then I'm going to go straight attack speed. Um, Honestly, I'm down for the Berserker Shield play. I'm down. I like that play. What's the cooldown on this? 9.8 seconds, even with 20% cooldown. Kind of, kind of a long cooldown. Gonna bonk the shit out of him. Bonk. It didn't crit. Damn it. So a question. If I get crit chance, it doesn't affect my dart, right? Okay. My dart is gonna always be 35% no matter what. Uh, do you just die here, maybe? Please stop. Uh, okay. I mean, if that's the case, I don't know. I feel like, okay, you know one way to massively buff crit Ratatask here? Because I know he's like not good. Um, Is just let Dart 
take the effects of crit chance that you build. Because, like, if you build 100% crit chance, it's kind of stupid that, like, your dart that is supposed to be able to crit still can't crit, you know? He surrendered? A five minuter against crit rat? What the fuck? I mean, I'll take it, but I don't understand it. I'm in. I'm going to do another crit rat attacker game. Because I feel like that wasn't a real showcase. So I'll see you guys in the next game with real crit rat. What's up, boys? Welcome back. Dr. Absolute Zero. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That's all right. We're going to win. We're going to win. Because I've learned from my mistakes. Last game, I realized... Okay. Sorry, I, I didn't want to talk over Ratatasker. Um, I realized that crit Ratatasker is auto attack based. Now I'm still going to go bow and horn shard because I still need my abilities, but I can build auto attack based. Is there any cooldown uh, like attack speed item? Shoguns. <laughs> that doesn't help. Um, all right. Whatever. I mean, Soul Leader is always good, right? Soul Leader is always good. And then I just max my one. Because, like, it does more damage and shit. But, okay, so here's the thing. What if my two... What if I still max my two or my three instead? Because I need to clear until I get my acorn. And then I start maxing my one. Or is it better to max your one even though you're, you're sacking clear? Because it means that once you get your acorn, you have a better initial power spike. These are the things I'm thinking about. My my answer to said questions, I think it's probably better. You didn't pick up the red. To um, max your one and have a better initial power spike. He did red, but didn't pick it up. I don't know if he knows he didn't pick it up. Or maybe he does know and he wants blue buff, but he just didn't want me to have red buff. Bonk. I missed. I missed twice. Whatever, it's fine. You die here. You either run or you die. You run or you die. You run or you die. You run or you die. Perfect. I um, mean, he's spawning in two seconds, so I, I really need to rush this. I have my alt in order to get TFO out of here. Hurry, please. I can save my alt. I can save my alt by running like a bitch. Oh lord, he's coming. Oh no, he ran away. Okay. Nice. Alright, catch me back in. <coughs> I'm gonna buy some pots. And then, uh, the reason I'm spending gold here, even though I'm so close to my acorn, like I've said so many times before, is because I can buy my acorn anywhere on the map. It doesn't really matter. I just need to make sure that I'm hitting my power spikes. Like right now, right now, hold on. Acorn. Okay, hold on, acorn. Fuck with fog, acorn. Now I crit him. Boom! It didn't crit. But look at that damage, though. And right, now you hop a Ruski. Okay, he died. My, how much does my one do? My one does 300 damage. And by 300, I mean 200, obviously. Which is pretty fucking ridiculous because of the fact that, like, literally, what does he do against it? Other than, like, hopping over it with his one, he just has to get smacked by it. And, God forbid it crits. Oh my God, it's a Jover for him. He loses a quarter of his health for free. But I have to let the minions come back out because I can't I can't dash into tower. Does my one clear backline? Even if it doesn't crit. Nope. Ow. Alright, hop, hop, hop. Oh my god. Bonk. Oh. Holy shit, that did 400 damage. Oh, 
He only has a thousand health. I did 40% of his health in one hit. Holy shit. Huh? I didn't know that this power existed. I've never felt power like this. Can I do it again? I want to see it again. Boom. Oh my god. Holy shit. It chunked. Whoa. I'm going to do it again. Oh, I didn't crit that time. Stop trying to kill me. I want to kill you. 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 Crit. It didn't crit. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Okay. All right. I fake like I'm going this way, but then I go this way. The reason I fake it is because of his passive. He has no idea. He has no idea. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Okay. Okay, I shelled for no reason. Okay, I'm running away. He, he used his horn shard. All right, I run away. <laughs> okay, that was stupid. But, 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 come on. You got to admit, if I had more eight or more mana regen, that would have been a sick play. You have to admit. Ah! Fuck! Oh my god! Dude! What the fuck? I do so much damage! Even non-crit my one bonks for 250 damage. 350... Okay, I just crit for 419. I have 92 power, by the way. Why am I critting for 400 with 90 power? I don't know, you tell me. I don't know. You tell me. Go pick up that blue buff. I'm having a lot of fun right now. Hello. Bonk. I missed. Shit. I need cooldown for sure. That's like definitely mandatory, but I'll just get a breastplate whenever. Bonk. Dude. Oh, you know why I crit for 419 on that buff? Because my one gives me a 20% power spike. Or power or damage power thing. Big kill. Alright, cleared the wave. I got the tower. Do I get the red buff as well? Maybe. He does have two waves to deal with. He could choose to run past there, but like that would be a poor decision. I have 300 mana. I can fight him. Like for sure I fight this, right? Like I'm never scared here. Like pump damage. Oh my god. Alright, now you do a little hop ski doodle. Ah, man. Alright. Crit! Dude, why am I not getting lucky crits here? No, oh, his cooldown. His cooldown, dude. I was out cooldowned. Alright, I need more crit chance. Fuck serrated. This is why I lose games, by the way. Let's go bladed boomerang. And then after bladed boomerang, what is that? 25%? That's 20%, but this gives me 25%. And then we'll go Deathbringer. And then with those two items, that's 55% plus that. That's 25%. That's fucking 80%. That's 70%. That's 80%. That's 80% crit. Bet. <laughs> but right now, I only have 45% crit. And 35% of my ability. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Bonk. Actually, if I pick up my boomerangs, is that not like damn near 100%? Oh my god. Can I have this? This Phoenix? Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. Please stop. Is he coming? I think I'm safe. I think I'm safe. All right. I want Blink. I'm sure you guys know what I want to do with Blink. I want to go Hydras. And then I want to Blink 3 auto attack and watch him explode. Or Blink Dash 3 probably. Because the Dash, you got to remember. The Dash gives me a 20% power buff. Or damage buff on all my auto attacks. For like a long time. Damn it. Dude, my crit chance sucks. It sucks. I, I, I never crit. Eight auto attacks, only a thousand damage. Where's my crits? Iris, I pay you $2,000 to hack my account to give me better RNG. And this is what you give me. For actual serious. All right, you're running away. You're running away. All right, at least I didn't lose the red. I did have to use my relic and my ult to get there, but it's worth it. I need 2,100 gold so I can upgrade my, uh, my Deathbringer or get Deathbringer and upgrade it, I guess. That helps a lot. You're going to Bull Demon. I'm going to just clear the wave. We're going to act like we don't see each other ever. Bet. Deal. Deal. I want the I want the Deathbringer that when I crit, I lower my cooldowns. Uh, there's no way he's doing Death or Bull Demon, right? Again? He's not. Okay. Wait, was that the last game? Or was that this game? I don't even remember. His blue is down. Okay. I really just want to like do bold even. But I can't help but feel like I literally just will lose the game. Okay, never mind. My... Alright, oh, you're backing. I'm okay with this. I am A-OK -okay with this. You have no alt. You're backing now. I have no alt. It's fine. You throw that out. No big deal. Boom, pow, bop. Look at that damage, baby. Float him. Oh my god. And I got a minion in here. What if I just never let him back? And crit. Nice. Nice. Why oh, do we get the Phoenix too? All right. Now you can't crit Titan, which is the worst thing about this build. But I got to tell you, man, I'm a believer. I was not a believer when this started. That crit was decent. But like, I'm a believer now. Wow. 
Like, look how much damage I do, dude. Like, look at that. Oh my god. I just shred. I just shred. Actually shred. And with my crit Deathbringer that reduces my cooldowns, I dash, stun, two, pow, 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 pow. Dash, stun, two, pow, 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 pow. And it's just constant. Over and over and over and over again. I thought that crit was going to make me lose the game, but crit maybe is my most fun build. All right, I got one more build in mind that I'm going to try to do. That again might end up losing, but I'll see you guys in the next game. What's up, boys? Welcome back to the next game. Losing Bigfoot. More like big... Fuck. <laughs> All right, so my idea for this game is basically to just go maximum HP points, Omega Healy McGee, um, and then I'll, like, if he goes anti-heal, I'll just message him to, like, not do that. And that should win. I think. So I'm going back to Green Acorn. But I'm also going to be stacking HP. So, like, every item I get will have health on it. I might not have, like, the most amount of health, but it'll have some HP to the point where I feel at least somewhat comfortable. And then I think we're pogging. Right? Like, what if I steal his blue, though? No, because then if I don't get the blue, then I just lose the game. Because I tried that. Right? No, I haven't tried it yet, actually. Have I? Okay, but what if he invades me and steals my blue? And the only way to keep my blue is to invade him and do his blue. Alright, he didn't steal mine. Alright, it's time to fight. I'm body blocking. Thank you. That's fine. I am A-OK -okay with this. I want to get the minis here. Thank you. He's a little low. I mean, I'm lower than him, but like, not by that much. Oh, look at that damage. Look at that DMG, bro. Nice. He had beads. He didn't have shell. All right. Nice. Very, very good, dude. It, okay. It takes me like 11 years to kill this buff, but still good. Nice. And now I dash like big far away. I back and make sure that he never kills me and then I get green orb or acorn. Upgrading offensive protocols. Oh, what does Gaia do? 10 HP, 5 and 100 health. This increases my max health by 10%. I have a... I, is this scaling? Like, will it keep running checks on how, what my HP is and then adjusting the 10%? Or does it only do 10% of what you initially buy? Because if it's only 10% of what you initially buy, then isn't it better to like not buy your relic until, or your acorn until your full health build? I mean, bonk. Ouch. And I'm already healing for 63 in auto or an ability. I mean, bonk. You have no mana? Nice. No mana, no problem. How much is Gaia? 2,000? Oh, only 1,500. Okay, cool. So I will definitely get Baia. Baia? <laughs> I'll definitely buy Gaia on my next back. I'm sorry. I've been recording for three hours at this point. So my, <laughs> my brain is mush. He's going defense, which is fine because I don't care about that. Also, you know what's really good about Gaia in this matchup specifically is his three is a knockup. That's mine. Thank you. 
Yeah, but anyways, <laughs> his three is a knockup, so I get my guy actually proc. What's the bad thing about Gaia is that I I have thirty five power right now. All right, but I do have seventeen hundred health with two items, and I'm regenerating HP like mad because twenty five HP five plus the passive. And then 7% of my max health over time while getting Evergreen Acorn. Uh, passive, which is the heal. I should have hit him. I'm feeling good. All right, what's my next item? If I go health, it could go Shogun, so I get some attack speed. But I probably need something that does damage. Like a Toxic Blade. We'll go Toxic, because he's Oleron. Ow. Dude, he hit me. He did 250 damage and I didn't even hit him with an ability and I'm still full health. His regen's OP. Bonk. I'm not scared of you. I'm not scared of you. Bonk. Dude, look at that. I actually heal so much. I just took a thousand damage. All right, he's backing. I apologize about the coughing. Like I said, I, I think I am getting a bit sick. <clears throat> I've been going on walks for six days in a row now, and uh, it's been getting cold outside. And it rained one day. And I think the day it rained, I was like cold and wet and I got sicko mode it'll pass it'll pass bonk I do legitimately no damage bonk Look at that healing, man. Boop. Bro, look at my healing, though. Look at my... He did 1,100 damage, and I'm only missing 400 health. <laughs> Holy... Fog. Oh, my God. Not on my watch. Come here. He can't kill me. I'm invincible, dude. I'm a two item invincible god. I am I am the fountain. Holy shit. This is crazy. Alright, what's my next item? I'm thinking Toxic Blade. It's only 100 HP. Oh, Wait, my thing heals me. Oh my god. Wait a second. My 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 thing heals me. Right? Oh, but it's I don't think oh wait a second. Bad news bears here. Bad news bears. I don't think vital amplifier will work. Because it's a with an, it's a heal off of an ability. And I don't think that it counts as an ability because I think it's my item that's healing me when I'm hitting my ability. I don't think it's actually my ability healing me. So I don't think vital will work, which is unfortunate. But CAD Club definitely works. I mean, CAD Club 100% works. And Sekmets... I, I actually don't think Sekmets works either. Because Sekmets is off of an ability as well. Okay, so that's unfortunate, but at least we got, at least we got CAD Club. I could go Pestilence, actually. How much? I, I, Pestilence is 250 health, right? 200. Used to be 300. Oh, the days. 
Bro, I just straight up heal. That heals my mana too? It's max health and mana. No wonder I can be crazy. No wonder I'm allowed to W key the shit out of him. He's going toxic, Blade. Hey, <laughs> he's going toxic. Bonk. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Ah! Bonk. Nice. That's my Gaia. That's my Gaia. It's all according to plan. It's all going to plan. Let's go, baby! All right, I do actually no damage at all. <laughs> I guess it makes sense. You have 65 power. You're not going to hit for shit. All right. That's okay. Uh, we can sell this. Let's go Toxic Blade now because I do need some sort of damage if I want to win the game. And then uh, I could go Emperor's Armor. Like I know that's a physical defensive item. But it lets me dive really easy. I have 2600 health. That toxic blade is going to make me sad. Bonk. We come back. Wait, I'm not done with you. Wait, I'm not done with you. Wait. Okay. All right. He got very scared very fast. Now, I don't need blue buff. Well, I do kind of need the cooldown, huh? Actually, not kind of. I do need the cooldown. Okay, what's, what's health and cooldown? These items. Okay, I have 10% because of Cla CAD Club. That's it. Uh, I guess I can go Gladiator Shield, maybe. I just picked up blue for some reason, even though I said I don't need blue. Whatever. Um. How am I to win? How am I to win this game? Uh, I actually have no clue. I have no idea how to win. I'm pretty sure he's just like waiting for me to do bull demon but like he should know that i absolutely cannot do bull demon that hit me unlucky what the I heal 200. He just beads. I heal 200 uh, HP whenever I hit him with an ability. Ah, oh, fuck. Okay. I need cooldown. Let's go Shoguns. That's going to give me 20%. And then I'll go Red Pot. And that's going to give me 40 power and 10%. So now I have 30% cooldown. I have 30% and then I can sell Bao for Genji's. Because Genji's has health with it as well. I have 3,000 HP. What the fuck? My attack speed is crazy. 
I hit for like eight, but like it's fast. <laughs> oh, blammo. Look at that damage. Look at that damage. I definitely don't care about picking up blue, like I said before. And now I actually mean it, because I do have 30% cooldown. Do I just say fuck it and, like, try to do this? Like, I definitely can't. Okay, never mind. I can. That's the same. Body block. Thank you. <clears throat> I don't care if uh, he's hitting me. I just needed my minions to get in range. Because he, like, he absolutely cannot kill me. Like, let's just get that clear. Even with a full Toxic Blade on me, I heal for 100 in ability. You cannot hurt me. Body block. Right, let's go get red buff. Oh, he's double defense. He got contagion too. Damn, I need some sort of pen. But I don't think that there's a pen item. You don't need a fuck pen. Fuck pen. Who cares? Just get Genji's. We fully upgrade this to give me cooldown and more healing, obviously. And this is the build. 3,300 HP. 3,300 HP, 170 magical protections, 120 power. Plus 30% increased healing. Plus Stone of Gaia healing. This is like actually ridiculous. How do you beat it? Newsflash, you don't. That's his ult. I healed for 216 just now. 200, 200, 200, 200. All I'm healing for is 200. I'm a 200 man. Boom. Ah. Boom. Boom. Ah. Bro, you actually can't kill me. Oh my God. Oh my God, man. I, I, uh, what do I say? That's crazy. Dude. Okay. I take it all back. Ratatasker's the best. I'm sorry for ever saying it. He's not. Uh, I'm shit with Ratatasker, but he's actually the best dual god I've ever played. My bad. I suck. GG, you're the best losing Bigfoot. Thanks for playing. Um, love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, boys. Peace.